The first camera is Sony IMX323 center. Second camera is Sony Starvis center. Uh, third one is High Risen D7 range. And the fourth is Sony Starlight. The Starlight is quite new. Um, stocks arriving end of August 2017. Uh, the first camera is the cheapest. Cameras two and three are similar price, and camera four is three times the price of the first one and twice the price of two and three. Main thing to look out for is the sharpness of our telephone number on the billboard and the distant building in the middle of the screen, uh, especially markings on the roof. So, this is the first camera. Our second camera, the Starvi Center. Third camera, the Height Risen D7. Although we don't know what manufacturer's um, sensors this company uses on this particular model. Image is slightly darker, but we've not adjusted anything. They are as factory default. Uh, the last one, Sony Starlight Sensor. Next, I'm going to compare the images at night of all four cameras. It's exactly the same order as before. Uh, no adjustments made at all. So again, same thing to look out for, which is the telephone number clarity nearest, the van sign and the roof and the background. It's some blooming on one of the cameras. It's not noticeable, it's hardly noticeable, but it is a little bit more than the others. That's the only reason I mention it. Blooming occurs when there's bright lights uh, towards the camera itself. Also look out for the sensitivity, uh, which will show up in dark areas in this particular scene look out between the two buildings in the far distance you'll see on camera 4 it's uh, lit up pretty well lit up because that camera is very sensitive to light so camera 1 in full screen this is the IMX 323 center I'm going to zoom into the distance it's a good way to see uh, how it sharp the image remains if you use the digital zoom to camera 2 which is the Sony Starvis Center again just zoomed in this camera is quite sensitive to light uh, but not good as cameras 4 so in this scene I don't think it's being shown to its full abilities on to camera 3 which is the height risen D7 range this is a uh, digital zoomed in, so you can see the sharpness and the sensitivity, especially between the two buildings. And now on to the last camera, which is the Sony Starlight. This is quite new, we haven't actually got stock of this until the end of August 2017. But as you can see, it remains in color. Uh, Colors are better where there's LED lighting instead of the sun lighting on the main site. You can just about make out the skyline. Uh, but as you can see all around, the images are pretty sharp and in color. 
hoping to test the starlight and the starvis in lower lighting to see what the main differences are in uh, even lower light right I'm forwarding this on to about four o'clock in the morning as you can see the the cheapest camera of, of the four um, the first one has come into color already just going to back it up a little hopefully try and find some movement because this is an industrial state early morning right i think that's about it i'll leave you to judge for yourself which one you believe is the better camera uh, you'll obviously need to take the prices into consideration um, when selecting please comment on the video and um, please subscribe thank you